Certainly as we go forward through the week, we are anticipating more and more just fun and festivities to go. Matter of fact, we're going to take a peek here at your forecast preview. We are looking for some sunshine, and that's right. It's Victory Monday. It's hundreds all around, y'all. Dollar, dollar bills, yo. <laughs> How about that? All right, let's talk real, though. We do have uh, some clouds that are going to be around, a little murky in the morning, some fog hanging with us. Temperatures in the 20s in the morning will be partly cloudy through the afternoon. Yes, we will get to see some sunshine. And once we get into the evening, a little bit of the moon peeking out as temperatures are going to be topping out in the 30s. Right now, the big story is the lack of wind here in northeast Ohio. That's allowed temperatures to cool back into the 20s. But you see our wind streams there, those little white moving lines, they're really just kind of moving around in their own thing. That means it's a calm wind. We're not seeing any appreciable wind flow out there. So we uh, do have some light fog that has been developing that will continue to descend as we head through the night tonight, but we are not anticipating any thick fog here in Northeast Ohio. Meanwhile, we also have some clouds that are streaming overhead and those clouds uh, are kind of um, a sign that um, we really have just a little wave of energy that's moving through. We can't really hang our hat on any certain front or system in this kind of a case. We're between everything. There is a pretty significant storm system that is down in Texas. You may have heard about that. They had six plus inches of snow in central Texas. Meanwhile, now they're getting snow down into uh, portions of Louisiana. And there's winter storm warnings and advisories all the way into Alabama. So it's pretty intense. That storm system stays south and east of us. We don't have to worry about it. But you can definitely see those few clouds that are kind of kind of hanging out right over Ohio here. Uh, and those may be just enough to get a few random flurries popping up. We're not really going to go with any flurry chances per se, but we could be seeing a few of those little flurries. Now, the bigger picture definitely is one that is very interesting. You can see a significant change. It is startling. The continental U.S. here, notice there's just not a whole lot going on. And you can't help but see this huge swirling mass of clouds. That is what will eventually become our pattern shift that is going to be settling in here by the time we get to Friday. So in the meantime, National Design Mart hour by hour forecast. Temperatures are holding in the upper 20s to near 30 to start the day tomorrow. We will have a southwest wind that begins to develop in the morning, and that should be enough to propel temperatures back into the mid-30s by midday. Notice that we start to see the clouds, the fog breaking up, and in the evening, we are going with those partly cloudy skies. Now, temperatures will be cool tomorrow evening once again, but as you can see, we break out in clearing. And once we get into the day on Tuesday, then we're going to flirt with the cloud deck that's off to the north of us. So we are going to continue on with the chances for clouds in the forecast. We'll call that variable cloudiness. Here's your Union Home Mortgage 10-day outlook. Temperatures holding in the 30s here with that mix of clouds and sun Monday and Tuesday. Partly cloudy, beautiful for Wednesday as we start a warming trend. This is ahead of that significant pattern change. Usually before we get a cool down, we will warm up. So there's the warm up and there you see the cool down that comes in. Now, it is a pretty significant change, meaning we will go back to more wintry weather as we go through the weekend and into next week. Kind of an unsettled and what could be a rapid fire pattern setting up, Sarah, with a series of storm systems passing through. Definitely going to keep us on our toes. So on our Victory Monday and this beautiful week ahead, we're just going to kick back and chill and enjoy <laughs> the weather.